I mean, they are they are kind of ahead. Of the, I want to say they are ahead of the, ahead of the curve here, as far as how you look at them having seven undrafted free agents. Look at guys like Martin, Vincent, Duncan Robinson was great. I thought Duncan, especially last two games. I know he missed two big threes in the uh, last game, but they they don't even sniff that 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 comeback isn't possible in Game Six, if not for Duncan Robinson's uh, fourth quarter. Some of the plays he made, some of the shots he made. You saw, I mean, you saw Duncan Robinson taking people off the dribble, cutting, passing. He blocked the shot last night. He he just, well, maybe that was Game Six where he blocked the shot and then took someone off the dribble. But Duncan Robinson was was great in the series. Like Duncan Robinson, uh, he shot the lights out. And he, he, his defense was good enough to keep him on the floor. Remember, in past postseasons, especially the last couple of postseasons, that was the issue with Duncan Robinson. He couldn't stay on the floor because of how how poorly he was on the defensive end. Defensive end. That was not the case in this series. He he was tremendous. Uh, their role players, those, those role players were were spectacular. Uh, even Highsmith, the limited time he got starting in Game Six, he picks. Man, he picks uh Jason he picked Jason uh, Tatum clean with something that's something that you that's that's how I knew you knew Jason Tatum wasn't right. Because he never gets picked like that. He picks he picks his pocket and leads to a layup. And um Miami's ahead of the curve. They're frankly ahead of the curve as an organization because the way and we're not gonna I'm not gonna go too heavy into the CBA. Um I'm not gonna go too heavy into it in for this uh podcast, but the way the CBA is gonna be constructed it is not going to lend itself to teams stacking their rosters. You're not going to be able to have three and four All-Stars. Those days, those Super Team days I were over to me beforehand. Now, they are absolutely officially over from that standpoint. You are going to have to draft well. You're going to have to play develop well. You're going to have to do, you're going to, you're going to, you're going to, have to find a number of hidden gems. Yes, you're going to have money to get two stars on your team, to pay a couple of stars, but Outside of that, you don't have to do it the way Miami is doing it. And when you look at Miami's four year run, they go finals, first round, conference finals, NBA finals. That's a hell of a run. 